I'm Pat Gunn, and we're playing Skyrim. So, what we are doing is we are heading east to steal the uh, the ownership papers for a um, for a horse that was sold to somebody despite uh, the person selling it not actually owning it. Looks like this person was killed by the Spriggan th that we fought at the last of the last, uh, fought in the last moment of the last episode. We're going to continue east and head down. Aha! And you can see we are going to be enjoying our new ability of bound weapons to. Capture souls without our needing to cast Soul Trap anymore. That is pretty handy. Almost, come on. Okay. Now this cabin is going to be pretty exciting to break into. Okay, this is it. So there's two ways you can do this. If you have fantastic sneak ability, or if you have the invisibility spell, then you can, uh, then you can just sneak in without any uh, risk. Uh, nice kill cam. Except I missed. I like that the game has enough of a sense of humor to show you the kill cam when you don't actually score a kill. Anyhow, seems like there are chickens running all over the place. So the Blackbriars, I mentioned them earlier, they control Riften. They're an immensely powerful uh, clan. And they have hired guards here. They have their own kind of military force. Now they're kind of sort of acceptable targets to the extent that uh, they're not exactly lawful people. They are ch talking their their ass off. Unfortunately, doing that has alerted pretty much everyone in the house uh, to me, and that means Anybody there? Uh, it will not be too long until basically everybody decides I don't feel super bad about them because they are pretty douchey, but, oh, yeah, this is one of those quests where if it, 
where my thoughts about it do supposed to be in here. Okay, so this is a downside. I didn't know this about Juzargo. Some followers, they um, they change uh, their uh, their interaction style if you happen to be somewhere that you shouldn't be. And this is... It seems like Juzargo is one of those. And this is a master lock, so it's particularly hard to open. To try just turning it a little so it's more than that. Now, if you really want to do this right, you're going to pay attention to the tiny little markings uh, on the side of the lock itself and see, like, there's little grains that you're going to use to remember where you've been most successful in turning it. So we're a little bit past... There is... Uh, the start of a band of, of darkness over here. So we're a little bit past that. Didn't go far enough. Almost. Let's see if it's to the right. Yep, a little bit to the right of that. 250 gold, that is good. But yeah, Jizargo doesn't want to trade with us while we're inside, while we're in the, inside the house. So we're gonna need to step outside to give him some of this armor that we've looted. Um, so, Gizargo has heard. Gizargo only has so much room to carry things. So we will give him all the steel plate. I hope he's not wearing it. Is he wearing it? No, that's good. Okay, we and, and now we're. Uh, we're back under capacity, and we can head back in, and we probably want to uh, light up the place a little bit. And now let's bring into being a bound sword. So all this stuff does count as stealing. So pretty much the only thing that I'm going to take are either alchemy ingredients or gold, because anything else is kind of hard to uh, to sell. Okay, there, those are the lineage papers. Two gold, nice. And I could keep on wandering through the house uh, to loot more stuff, but I, I've done what I uh, came here for, and there's no real use in killing everyone. We need anything else? Is this the horse? Yeah, this is Frost. So we are going to take Frost to uh, to the person who bought it. Um, hopefully, just Argo won't mind chasing after me. I didn't think that the candlelight spell would stay active while I'm on horseback, but apparently it does. Uh-oh. Well, maybe so, but I'm not going to stick around to see what happens when I get lost near you. And here is Latrush. Let's get down and give him the horse. Ha! You've done it. Got to admit, I wasn't sure you could pull it off, but you've definitely earned your pay. Yes, yes, here it is. I think I first be off now. Okay, twelve fifty gold is acceptable pay. And looks like Desargo uh, wandered up. And uh, so, that's another quest done. Now, we do... Uh, 
we have a lot of stuff that we probably should sell. So we will return to Riften. And we're going to improve all that armor if uh, if we have uh, if we can cheaply buy the uh, basic materials to improve it, which I think is probably steel. And uh, then we'll mage it up and sell it to our friendly uh, smith friend. Really nice looking sword there. Still not sure about those uh, handles, though. Okay, so it's kind of late at night. We are going to see, yeah, you're probably not still selling stuff. And I have not yet trained this level, but he's a little bit expensive to train with at this level of, uh, of Smith uh, for me. Oh, so he just went home at 1 a.m. 6, 7, Eight, nine. Okay, he should be showing up shortly. So that is one of the goofy things about the way that uh, people spawn in this game. You've been a good friend to me. That means something. In that the uh, when you hit a certain time, generally the. Uh, they're not just there when you stop waiting. They uh, they just kind of materialize uh, pretty often. Actually, I should see what what materials I need to improve this uh, this stuff. Oh, I don't have the skill to improve that stuff. Oh well, that's disappointing. Okay. So I am gonna run home. Yeah, at some time I'm going to have to uh, get that perk to improve uh, or to make and improve uh, plate stuff. I thought I already had it, but I seem to be misremembering. So. I am your sword and your shield. No, Jizargo is my sword and shield. Oh, we still have that Dwemer, those Dwemer cogs to deliver. I should stop forgetting to drop those off. Okay, well, let's head down and enchant. Wait, where is... Oh no, actually... Okay, so I, I can improve that stuff. The, pro uh, the, pro the reason that didn't show up is that I gave it all to Jisargo and forgot that it wouldn't show up there. Oh well. Oh, whoops, I did not mean to take that. Let's give him his armor back. And I only took one steel plate armor from him. Jezargo only has so much room to carry things. Okay. Lead on, friend. So, we are going to enchant this stuff up nicely. I think you get the same experience when using uh, petty soul gems as you do uh, using nicer ones. So if you're just going for the uh, experience, 
you shouldn't waste your uh, your nicer f uh, filled soul gems on uh, on leveling. Now let's see. Now that we do have a dark uh, soul gem, it's probably wise that we um, always try and use it whenever we're uh, we're maging. So I have a right ring. And this increases magic resistance by 16%, the one I'm wearing now. Although, what other options do I have? So I could improve the right ring or a, a necklace. Have a, a necklace of Smith 13, and I have a necklace of. Beachcraft, and Bow 22. Smith 13 and Bow 22. Can I improve on either of those? Smith 13, Bow 22. Smith 20. Okay, that is definitely nicer. Um... The huh, that's weird. I was so sure that I had chosen the uh, okay, I made a mistake. I was meaning to use the black soul gem. And initially, I must have used a Grand Soul Gem instead. Whoops. Okay, and I do seem to have a spare bow here. Might as well... Do that, and... I'm really tempted to get rid of one of these bows. As a matter of fact, I think I am going to get rid of the glass bow for now. I might take a, a better regular bow. 1249. Oh, Turn on Dead is actually worth more. I might take a better regular bow when I can make a better regular bow. But for now, for bowing, I'm going to rely on uh, a bound bow. And Jizargo, if you can hold some of this stuff for me. Then, uh. Ah, oh, shoot, I, I'm not using consistent naming. If you can hold some of this stuff while I head up, that would be handy. And after this, I'm going to head up to the College of Winterhold to drop off these cogs, because they're taking up quite a lot of uh, weight. Come to see Balaman perform miracles with steel, eh? Okay, so he's going to come over. You call yourself a wizard? I challenge you to a duel. Oh, really? The gods will be the judge of that. Great. Just what I wanted. Bound sword and shield of major blocking. Whoa. Oh, 
Okay. So that was my challenger. Let's see who died. So I did say earlier on that if characters I considered essential enough were killed, then I would uh, bring them back with the console. And I'm going to do that. Yes. Okay, so what, what are you going to do, dude? Hopefully... He is no, he's walking back to his Smith. Jezarko has heard of the staff of Magna. Jezarko only has so much room for carry things. Okay, so we're gonna take the steel plate armor back from Jezargo. And we are going to sell it. Oh come on. Hopefully he isn't too upset by having just been killed. Uh, where did he go? Ah, there he is. No, come back. Come back. Dude. D dude, stop. Wait. Dude. What do you need, my friend? Come to see Balaman perform. Nothing like the smell of a white hot. Okay, so he doesn't seem interested in trade at the moment. So I'm gonna head over to one of the other characters that will buy and sell stuff. And let's see what I'm wearing right now. I am wearing. Weren't there more steel plate? Now we have two steel plate armors that we use different strengths of enchantment on. So let's talk to her. You gonna buy just what you see here? Well, I should put that on. Amulet of Debella. Back when you're ready. You're gonna stick just what you see here. It should improve the prices. Okay. Come back when you're ready to spend more gold. Greetings on the ivory from this tusk will be perfect for the Okay, area. extra 100 gold. And is there anything else that I can sell that he would like? Major circlet. Looks good. And when we're in. Safe travels, land strike. See if he's feeling any better. Looking for some armor? No. A weapon, perhaps? Okay, that is irritating. There seems to be a bit of a bug there. But we're, uh, there's a chance that it'll just be fixed by um, uh, by tomorrow, since characters do live on a schedule, and maybe uh, just being killed and resurrected um, reset that schedule for him in some way. He might be better tomorrow, hopefully. If not, he's still willing to train me in smithing if I can uh, scrounge up the money. Well, it will be kind of inconvenient if he's no longer uh, uh, willing to sell me raw materials. Okay, so... Jarl's Longhouse... Oh. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. I've got a letter and a lot of gold. Something about it being your... Uh, oh, inheritance! Oh, and sorry for your loss. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Okay, so that actually was for uh, Balamin's dying, because his death triggered uh, triggers that kind of thing. I'm getting out of here. Oh shoot! Great, just what we uh, just what we wanted—a dragon to show up. So. And we're going to s get ourselves a, a bound bow as soon as we can scrounge up the magicka to do it. 
and we're going to switch to our amulet of bow damage here. Come on. There we go. And where is the dragon? It is up there. Fortunately, it is now almost dead. So we just need to figure out where it's going to land and go visit it. And that took care of it. But all those uh, dragon bones seems to have put me over the weight limit. I'm not sure where Jatargo went. I hope he didn't die somehow. Oh, no, there he is. Cool. So, we are going to give him our dragon bones. And dragon scales, and that'll put us back under the uh, weight limit. Then we're going to head to the store over here. And at the general store here, we will hopefully be able to sell the other two um, plant males. You know, so let's put back on that amulet of Tabella. I'll sell just about anything if it's worth my time. Keep that in mind. I do what some may call this junk. Me, I call them pressures. So there are some stock phrases that are a little bit uh, overused in the game. And sometimes you end up hearing the same stock phrase recorded um, uh, for several different uh, characters. And that's a little bit weird, but such is life. It's apparently uh, a lot better than the previous games in the series, where they only had maybe five or six different seiyu. Whereas here I think they have something like 20 or 30 different seiyu. Okay, so I'm looking for Arneal, or is it Arneal? Might be Arneal. Let's find out. He is off to the left. Yep. And I have his cogs ready. Which will free up a lot of weight for us. Uh, is he still in here? Okay, he is in here somewhere. And what room is this? This is uh, Tolfdir's room, I think, or it might be uh, Jasargo's room. Hey, Tolfdir, I have hey, your... I can't. If you happen to see it, would you mind? Oh, I thought I already returned it. I need it for some research and can seem to find it. Until next time. The problem is you can do that quest so many times it's easy to forget what the state of it is. I'm working on some odd. I'm afraid I cannot well, thank you again. If I require anything else. As a matter of fact, I had ret but now he's refusing to deliver. Could you perhaps speak with him and he asked I think the Thalmor are I haven't told him anything, of course. Okay. What I'm doing is far and I have to talk to Enethir about another thing he has that perhaps he shouldn't have. Uh, I don't really need any more. Okay, hey, in the fear. You think you can do what he can and I'll... I, it's nothing dangerous, so the problem is... So you bring that stuff back here and I'll consider it payment for the item Arniel was... Okay. The 
exact nature of my research is a secret, I'm afraid, but it really is quite valuable. So that's what we need to do in here. Was this the... Okay, it might have been the other chamber that was... Uh, All right. that had the enchanting stuff and the other characters. So we are going to head over there. And I don't think we've done our five trainings uh, for this level yet. So we will pick one of these guys and try and figure out a skill that we could use some uh, use some extra levels in and do some training with them. If we happen to spot... Okay. Uh, he's the enchanting trainer, but... Not again. Uh, seems like he's really in the mood to run. Maybe this is how Khajiit stay uh, healthy. Okay, that is not refreshed. Remember whose room that is. Might have been uh, the healer uh, trainer. I can't remember her name. Where is everybody? It's an empty room. There's the destruction trainer. And this is the illusion trainer, Drevis, I think. Wait, where was he? Oh, he's right over here. Hey, dude. Take a look. Do you have. Do I have anything you want? Cool. Okay, you can sell that. This, this. Sweet, so we can get rid of some of our junk and uh I shall explain to you the mysteries of the outer realm. Okay. And let's see if the, if there are any more books that we can get from him. So rally is kind of tempting. Uh, because we could cast rally on Jasargo uh, when he's fighting and he'll... Uh, Actually, I think we will get rally. I could be free of the mundane day-to-day -day spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. So he actually uh, has my favorite voice in the game, I think. So there's rally. Yeah, I think we're gonna go with rally. And. Oh yeah, we need to use the item before we can uh, memorize it. Well, and now we will memorize rally, and we're going to st stop. Uh, we're not going to be using the spell soul trap anymore because we have bound weapons. And I think that's probably all that we're going to do here. Um, and that's also enough for this uh, let's play. I will see you in the next one.